in, everybody. Glad you're with us. The show has AAA baseball for you. It's the Durham Bulls taking on the Buffalo Bisons. And now, your Buffalo. First pitch coming at you right after the break. So just about set now, Vidal Brujan. One and two now. And the one two misses to even the count. Found back our way, and that's out of play. Left hand batter waits. Slapped foul. The two two. And down on strikes. One gone here. So up next, Tristan Gray. The 3-1. That's out to center field. Racing makes the catch. Out number two. Here's the center fielder, Josh Lowe. No score just getting started top of the first. Tied him up inside with that one. Boom, that's cheddar, baby. And a ground ball to first, and that's just foul. And a swing and a miss, and that's that. We go to the bottom of the first. Digging in is the switch inning outfielder, Dexter Fowler. Glass now, ready and deals. And fouled off. Well, the hitter's got his timing down for the breaking ball. If you're a pitcher, if you can get that fastball in on the hand, it's going to be very difficult for that hitter to get the barrel to it. Swing and a miss. The velocity blasted it right past him. Here's the second baseman, Otto Lopez. At the belt and fires. Strike two. Out there on the mound, he's setting the tone early with the fastball. 98 miles per hour up on the scoreboard. One down, base is empty. And a swing and a miss. Back-to-back -back strikeouts. Josh Fuentes getting ready to hit. Next pitch is downstairs. Next offering is fouled back. First two hitters get punched out on strikes. Take some notes from the dugout when you get your chance. Got him. Strikes out the side to begin the game. What a start. Back here at the ballpark. Now the third baseman, Jim Haley. And a pitch. And one and two. Clearly he was sitting on a fastball right there and just ended up out in front of the slider. Hey, you can't fault him for his commitment. Now he's just going to have to battle two strikes. The pitch. That's towards center. Warmoth on his way over. No trouble here. Puts it away for the out. One down. And stepping in is the speedy Luke Rayleigh. Here's a 1-1. Bounced out to short. Groshans over to pick it up. Two up, two down at the top of the second. Now it's going to be number 62.
2-2 now. Just inside, and now it is filled up. Swing and a miss. Struck him out. And good work there as he gets a 1-2-3. Bottom half of inning number two. And now the first baseman, number 96. Next one misses, and it's two and one. Two balls, one strike, the count. Righty to the plate. Just off the outside edge. And the right-handers 3-1. And that one is lifted in the air. Rayleigh makes the grab. One away. Gabriel Moreno digs in now. The catcher. Gabriel Moreno. The pitch. And a foul ball. One, two. Swing and a miss. And he's down on strikes. Another strikeout for Glass now. Two outs, base is empty. Cullen Large will hit next. Ball to strike. Two balls, one strike. Smash to the left side. Base hit. That was smoked through the infield. And that extends the inning. Seems like he got exactly what he was looking for right there. Everyone's trying to elevate the ball in today's game, but if you can hit a ball that hard on the ground, it's going to find some holes. So now one and two. And a pitch. Way inside, gets out of the way. Straighten him up a little bit. Left-hand hitter waits. And a foul ball, he stays alive. The pitch. Swing and a miss, and that is that. And welcome back. Now it's the DH, number four. One, one now. And downstairs. The two one. This one popped up. Lopez under it. Puts the squeeze on it. And there's one away. Here's the left fielder, Ruben Cardenas. This one in the air, right field. Makes the grab, and there's two gone. Now the catcher up to hit, Rene Pinto. Top of the third, no score. The next pitch misses, and it's two and one. Right-hander kicks, deals. Just missed. That's where you want it. It's a good miss. And the 3-1. Fought off foul. And a pop-up. Right side. Foul territory. Tracks it down for the out. And that is that. Welcome back, set for the bottom of the third. And now, Logan Warman. Next offering is down low. Three and one. The pitch. And a foul ball. Fouled off again, and it remains three and two. And here it comes. Bounce to the left side, and it goes just foul.
stays alive. Got him. Now one away. Here's Jordan Groshans. The punch out there picks up strikeout number seven. Now it's Dexter Fowler. Dexter Fowler. The pitch. Swings through that one out in front that time. Two down, nobody on. And that one moves his feet. The next offering misses. And it's three and two. And the pitch. And a foul ball, he stays alive. Payoff pitch. Fouled off again. And it remains three and two. Payoff pitch. Swing and a foul ball at the plate. They'll do it again. He was a little out front, but did a good job keeping the hands back long enough to foul that pitch off. The right-hander gives up the two-out walk. One of the things about that two-out walk, the base runner over at first base is going to have a very aggressive secondary lead. So a ball down the line or into the gap will produce a two-out RBI, and those are the best. That is, if you are the offensive side of it. And he deals. Swing and a miss, and he struck him out. And he's down on strikes for the second time today. Back here at the ballpark as we go to the top of the fourth. And now it's the switch hitting second baseman, Vidal Brujan. Righty delivers. And that one now almost two, got him. One. Here comes a pitch. That one fouled off, two and two. And the pitch. This to third. Fair ball. So a runner aboard to start the inning. Just a simple ground ball the other way. They had eyes on it, man. Sometimes that's all you need to do. Just let the ball travel, put the ball in play, and just hope it finds a hole. Now at the plate, Tristan Gray. swinging and that's the first out so digging in Josh Lowe left hand batter waits strike two he's pitching well but not throwing a ton of first pitch strikes usually doesn't work out for success but you can never predict baseball next offering misses and the counts even at two and the right-hander deals. And that one goes straight to the backstop. The 3-2 is off the outside edge, and that is ball four. Well, they didn't give him anything to hit, and now with runners on first and second, they've set up a double play opportunity. So not a terrible result. Pitch misses inside, and that's ball three. Is there a little wrinkle to that? I think there was. Yeah. A little slider action. Swing and a miss, and it's a full count now. Kicks and deals. Foul ball there. Two on, one out. On the ground, right side. Fires to second for one. Back to first. Double play. Nice job getting over, and that ends the inning. Ready to go, bottom four. Here's the third baseman, Josh Fuentes. The 1-1. One, one. 
And a foul ball. He needs a quick one, two, three this time around. Last inning through a lot of pitches. Next offering is way upstairs. Kicks and fires. Stays alive. Got him. Leadoff hitter retired in the fourth. And next will be the cleanup hitter, number 96. And it is two and one. And a pitch. That's down and in. Here's an opportunity to do some damage and perhaps unlock this offense. 3 1 count. Be ready to turn on a fastball. And the righty deals. Swing and a miss as he was out front that time. And a foul ball. He stays alive. Righty to the plate. And a swing and a miss. Down on strikes. Already two gone here in the home fourth. Two out, space is empty. And now, Gabriel Moreno went down on strikes his first time through. At the belt and fires. And the slider catches the zone. He's pitching well, but not throwing a ton of first pitch strikes. Usually doesn't work out for success, but you can never predict baseball. Next one misses, and the count is two and two. Foul ball. Two outs. And it's filled up. Really good take, especially with two strikes. The pitch. And down on strikes he goes. The big right, he strikes out the side. New inning getting started, and now the right fielder, Luke Raley. On the ground, Lopez collects, gathers, and throws to first. And the leadoff hitter retired in the fifth. Well, he's doing a nice job of keeping the ball out of the air, lets the defense work behind him with another ground ball. Good execution. And a pitch. And another ball. Pretty good job on the mound in this one, Siggy. It feels like we've seen a lot of off-balance swings. Yeah, with just one free pass, and uh, obviously he's not a big strikeout guy, but he gets soft contact, and he gets out. Next is the designated hitter, number four. Swing and a miss, three and two now. I think he was sitting off speed there. That's to third. Fuentes picks it up, whips it to first. Out number three. Ready to go for the last half of the inning. And here is Cullen Large. Next pitch misses. Now two balls and a strike. And here it comes. On the ground to third. Haley picks it up. Tosses across the first. One up, one down. Now the batter down. Brock Lundquist. Swing and a miss. Struck him out. Two out. And now the center fielder, Logan Warman. Logan Warman. Got the bat going too soon in strike two. The pitch stays alive. Here's a one-two. 
He swings and hits a fly ball. Center field. Low makes the catch, and that'll do it. And welcome back. Top six. Stepping in, Ruben Cardenas. Here's a 1-1. Got him to chase one upstairs there. It really looks like these hitters have been in between with their timing today. Good fastball, excellent slider, but they've not been able to commit to one velocity and stay there. Lundquist should have this one. Makes the grab one away. Just pull off of it a little bit right there. That front shoulder coming open instead of staying closed. If he does that, he's going to be able to go up the middle the other way with some authority instead of a fly out to left. The pitch. Got him. So he's gotten deep into this game. And at least so far, not showing a ton of signs of fatigue. And now it's Vidal Bruhan. The pitch. And one and two. One ball, two strikes, Adele. in the air left field and a base hit so a two out knock keeps the inning alive really nice job a two strike hitting in that at bat that's a ball that a lot of times you'll see the shortstop or left fielder be able to get to if it hangs up in the air long enough but right there it just died and found a way to drop in on the green stuff a base hit and now two and one You could see he was trying to stay back long enough to handle the off-speed pitch, but just a little tardy on the fastball. Next pitch has popped up. And that will end the inning. Bottom of the sixth inning. Now here is Jordan Groshans. And here's a 3-2. Puts it in the air out towards left center. Low makes the catch. And there's one away. So the lineup flips over. Now, now it's the switch right hitting outfielder. Dexter, Dexter Fowler. Fowler. Righty delivers. Lined and that's a base hit. Spoiled that backdoor breaking ball perfectly. Stayed tall, didn't lean out towards it, let it get deep, and then just squared it up pretty nicely the opposite way. That's great hitting. Next offering is downstairs. And the pitch. Chopped left side. In plenty of time to first. He's out. And here is Josh Fuentes. There's 0 for 2 with a pair of strikeouts. Runner at second, 2 down. In the dirt. The tag, and that's out number 3, inning over. Welcome back. We go to the top of the 7th. Here's the center fielder, Josh Lowe. Right-hander kicks, deals. That misses. Now two and two. Good eye right there. So important for him to control the heart rate right now. He's got to go through the heart of this lineup. Late swing, foul to the left. Down on strikes. One out. Now, now the third baseman, third Jim Haley. Jim. Haley. 
And the right-hander deals. And that's outside. Pretty easy to give up on that pitch right there. Started on the edge of the plate with the spin. You know it's going to finish well off the plate. Swing and a hard hit liner up the middle to base hit. So the go-ahead run is on base with a knock. Now oh, just a nice job coming through in a pretty high leverage yeah, spot right there. That's about as textbook as it gets. Got his stride and load out of the way early. He stayed inside that ball and squared it up out front. Man, that was like he was in the cage hitting off a tee. They turn things over to the southpaw, Anthony Kay. One down, runner at first. Digging in, it's the speedy outfielder, Luke Rayleigh. And he dodges that fastball. Left center base hit. And that gets all the way to the wall. Around third. The relay throw. In there. He's safe. Two consecutive base hits for these guys here. I'll tell you. Man, it's such a good feeling when you smoke a line drive into the gap like that. I mean, sure, home runs are king, but I feel like nothing makes you feel like a true professional hitter more than a bolt the other way. He makes the grab. Runner tagging from third. The throws offline. He's saved. It's 2-0. Well, these guys understand how important each run is, especially as you get closer to the end of the ball game. Nice job right there to get that runner in from third and add a little insurance. The next offering misses, and it's two and one. Just off the inside edge. At this point in the game, you cannot issue free passes. He's going to have to challenge this hitter. Hitter's got to be ready to swing it. Swing and a high fly ball. Pretty well struck right field. Pulls it in on the warning track. here at the ballpark bottom of the seventh here's the third baseman Josh Fuentes kicks and deals that one misses so a lead off walk well he's starting to look a little gas to me and we'll see if they go to the bullpen in this spot or not no outs runner at first and here's the first baseman number 96 the tying run at the plate Fouled off left side. Tying run at the plate. And it's even up. Nobody out. Runner at first. And a swing and a miss. And one away in the bottom of the seventh. And here's the catcher, Gabriel Moreno. Next pitch has popped up. And there's two away. Boy, that was a hanging breaking ball right there. I think he tried to do a little bit too much. Sometimes those eyes can get really big. I think his swing broke down as well, and that's what caused him to pop it up. And he deals. And that's ball four. Well, it might be time to dig into that bullpen. He's looking a little fatigued to me. First and second, two outs. Next to hit, Brock Lundquist. Here comes a pitch. Ripped into left center for a base hit. Fuentes headed for the plate. Throw home, not in time. The run scores. And now they trail by one. Well, that at bat had a lot of pressure riding on it, so really great job coming through right there. It's got to feel good. Nice job of driving that pitch the other way on a line. You know, hitters, they take so many reps in the cages working on going to the opposite field, and it doesn't always translate into the game, but right there it did, and he did it perfectly. New pitcher on now, Jason Adam, and he'll work on holding this lead. So two down now, and here is Logan Warman. The next pitch misses. Two balls and a strike. 
Good spot for the hitter. Definitely has the advantage in this count with runners on. Look for him to be aggressive on this next pitch. Swing and a miss, and now two and two. Right-handed reliever. Got him looking. That ends the inning and stops things from getting out of hand. Joe Biagini taking over on the mound. Ready to begin the eighth. Now the left fielder, Ruben Cardenas. On the ground, out to short. Leadoff man is out here in the eighth. And now it's going to be Rene Pinto. pitch out towards right center field and no one can get there so the one out hit turns the lineup over now back, back to the top of the lineup and now here is Vidal Brujan 2-1 pitch is in there, and the count is even. Righty to the plate. And now it's filled up. One run game, one out, one on. Down the left field line, could be extra bases. And that one's going to get into the corner. Lead runner holds at third, so two runners in scoring position and just one out. So one out with two aboard. Now it's the shortstop, Tristan Gray. Here's a 2-1. In the air, left field. No trouble here, puts it away for the out. Both runners tagging. He's in to score on the sack fly, and they lead by two. Well, that's a quality at bat right there. You know the situation. You need something in the air and deep enough, and that's exactly what he did. Good pass to the baseball. Next one misses, and a count two and one. And that one wrapped foul. into center and that's the third out ready for the bottom of the eight and now Jordan Groshans and the righty deals Turned on, but that's foul down the third baseline. Here's a one-two. And a swing and a miss. One away. So the batting order turns over. Digging in is the switch inning outfielder, Dexter Fowler. Really good piece of hitting last time going to the opposite field. Next pitch inside, and that's ball three. Righty delivers. It's been tough for the offense so far, but you can't get frustrated. You got to find a way to shake it off, go up there and relax. That's the only way you're going to be able to put runs up on the board. Down the right field line and a base hit. Didn't exactly square that one up, but sometimes you don't have to. Pitch was away, so he definitely pulled off it there. Not what you want to do with the pitch in that location, really, but he was able to guide it into the outfield for the knock. Oh, now this one is blasted to right. 
Ford get it way back there and gone he'll touch them all and we are tied it's 3-3 digging in Josh Fuentes and a pitch and a pop-up on the left side of the infield. Pinto settles underneath it. Drops into the glove. Two away now. Got the pitch that he wanted. Just a little bit quick. Front shoulder open. Backside collapsed a little bit. And the launch angle not where he needed it to be. Fouls one off. Two and two. Left-hand hitter waits. That smash towards center. And that's a base hit. So he gets on base and keeps it going. Well, that was an important at-bat in this game, so a great job there stepping up to the challenge. I could watch base hits like that one all day long, and so could every hitting coach in the league. Just a nice line drive into center field. Tommy Romero gets the ball now. Here's the catcher, Gabriel Moreno. Kicks and fires. Two gone. The possible go-ahead run at first. Swing and a ball popped up. Bruhan under it. Makes the grab and that'll end the inning. back it's the top of the ninth and there's a new pitcher on the mound Andrew Vasquez we go to the ninth now the third baseman Jim Haley and a pitch that misses the zone. Two and two. And a pitch. And a foul ball. He stays alive. The pitch. Swing and a pop-up. Groshans pulls that one down. One up, one down. Well, such a confidence boost for a reliever to come into the ball game and get the first hitter he faces. Just makes everything slow down a little bit, and then from there can really settle in. Next offering misses, and it's two and one. There's a strike. No need to offer that pitch until you get to two strikes. It's just a low percentage of success when you want to try to go after that down and away pitch. Not even close there. And the count's full. Left hand batter waits. The 3-2 is off the outside edge, and that is ball four. And he's a guy that will certainly think about stealing a bag or two. Not the kind of speed you want to put on base in a tie game. Here comes the pitch. Here goes the runner from first. He swings and fouls one off. At the belt and fires. Out to center. Warmoth drifts towards it. He hauls it in. Two away. And next is the designated hitter, number four. A little surprised we don't see a pinch hitter here with the lefty-lefty matchup. And here it comes. And now it's filled up. 
Three, two, two out, runner on first. A lot of movement in the infield. Hitters got to stay focused on the pitch. Line drive, base hit. Runner around third on his way to the plate. Cut off, now a throw home. Not in time, he's safe at the plate. It's 4-3. Clutch hitting right there to give him the lead this late in the ball game. That was exactly what you're looking to do with the pitch away, especially in that situation. Drive it into the opposite field gap. He got himself two bags on a great swing of the bat. Well, got to pause on that thought as that'll do it for the inning. Nick Anderson in. And welcome back. Bottom of the ninth. And now the DH, Cullen Large. Next one is off the play. And now three and one. And that one fouled off. Anderson ready to work. Slow roller up the middle. Tosses to first. One out, bottom of the ninth. Here's the left fielder, Brock Lundquist. Left fielder, Brock Lundquist. And a 1-1. One -one. Left field, way back there. And it hits the fence. And the tying runs at second base with a double. Just a huge at bat right there. This was a really nice swing. Didn't quite get enough behind it to get it out of here, but once it got over his head in left field, it was extra bases all the way. At the play, Logan Warman. This to third, and there's a hit. Into third now, so runners at the corners and one out. There you go. Winning run is aboard with one down. Pretty tough for the infielders to do anything with that one. He pulled it hard into the outfield, and even when you keep it on the ground, it feels great when you hit a missile like that. Now, Jordan Groshans. On the ground to third. He pulls into second. A run comes in on the play. Huge at bat to bring home the tying run at this point in the game. Just a cookie down the middle. I mean, those are the ones you dream about. The ones in the cage, you're just hoping you get in the ball game. Right down the middle, not a whole lot of velocity. Right on top of it. Dustin Knight on the pitch here. And now the right fielder, Dexter Fowler. One away, and the game-winning run stands at second. Popped up to the left, into foul ground. pitch nope. <laughs> in the air to left center Cardenas long run into the gap no trouble here puts it away for the out two down now it's the second baseman Otto Lopez now that this is what stat nerds like myself oh. might call a high leverage situation. Yeah, Boog, not sure what the numbers say, but clearly an at bat that could change the course of this game dramatically. Tied to four. Just missed. Winning run and scoring position with two away.
here's ball four. Oh, that sets up a really big at bat in this game. These are the moments when everyone in the stadium gets really locked in. Two outs, bases full. Here's the third baseman, Josh Fuentes. Here's a 1-1. That clips the corner. Get a little frustrated with the strike zone. Bounce to third. Base hit, one run is in. The winning run crosses the plate, and they walk it off 5-4. Well, you come into the ninth inning down. First, you're looking to tie it. They did that, but then they got the extra to put themselves on top. These guys knew exactly what it was going to take to win this ball game. I love it when you see guys find a way to win, and that's what they did today. Close one here today, and your final 5-4. For Chris Singleton and our entire outstanding crew here at MLB The Show, I'm John Shambi saying so long. Seven hits, no error.